This is a test tube rack right here. It is used also to hold chemicals in the test tube, and it's also used after you clean it to dry it off. And how we're going to use it is we're going to stick it in the substance, we're going to try to find the temperature up, and what we use it is to find the temperature of that substance. We're supposed to use them with this groove. You use them to pour out the liquids inside the crucible. You also use the tongs so you do not burn your hands. Hi guys, this is a test tube. We use it for holding chemicals and also keep me from that stationary bed times. Well, hello guys, this is a test tube brush. And it's mainly used to clean the test tubes like so. And you basically have to put the test tube in here after you put like some dish liquid in there. And it's basically used to clean the test tube so you wouldn't have to clean, so you wouldn't have to uh, test chemicals. This is a test tube plant. <laughs> you use it by squeezing the two circles and grabbing the test tube. Why we use it? Because sometimes the test tube can be hot. This is a crucible. During your labs, you'll put it usually over a clay triangle. You'll have chemicals inside, and you'll bring the bottom of this so that you can see the chemical reactions inside the crucible. This is an iron ring stand. How to use it? You would put the Bunsen burner on the platform right here, and it's used so we don't burn our hands trying to heat things up. This is a clay triangle. You put it on the iron ring stand. And why we use it is so we, we don't burn our hands trying to heat things over the Bunsen burner flame.